Okay. Okay, hello. Hello, good morning. I, <laughs> I'm still, I'm still unsure about this, the stream deck. Still keeping an eye on it. I think it's doing okay, but also, I don't know, you know? I'm not going to uh, blindly trust it. Uh, I want to, I want to make sure I know what's going on. I want to make sure I know what's going on. Ionic, hello. Ionic, good morning. How the heck are you? How the heck are you? Okay, cool. We've got that ready to go. We'll close this tab. All right. Hello. I hope you're having a good morning. I hope things have been going well. I need to clean my glasses again. I'm just, I was sitting here cleaning my glasses for a minute. You know what? Let me, uh, let me get a little spray on them. Hang on. Where, where am I hiding that? Where did I hide? There it is. I was like, where did I hide the cleaning spray? Spray onto lens surface. You know, when it gets bad enough. There we go. Bish bash bosh. Doing good. Stomach has decided to calm down, which is nice. I'm gonna go to work in a bit. I'm glad you're feeling better. I'm very glad to hear that you're feeling better. I'm sorry you have to go to work. But at least, at least you're feeling better. So that's very good to hear. That's very good to hear, friend. Did you, hey, listen, don't, don't overshare. Did you figure out what happened? Did you just get a random stomach thing? Cause I hate that. I hate that when you're just like, you know, nothing's going on and you're just like, I feel bad. I hate that. If I at least understand why it happened, you know, it's one thing. It's one thing to understand why and it's another yeah. Um, it's another. I didn't. I'm concerned for food poisoning. Did you eat out at all? That's that is usually my go to. Um, if we eat, if we eat out and we haven't eaten out in a while. Um, and just like we just eat out and then we feel bad after. I'm like, eh, it's probably. You know, I'm not going to say like I'm the bestest foreverist at making sure food is fully cooked, you know, because like, hey, knock wood, you know, nobody's the best in the world. Um, but I also, um, you know, try my best. So I did the day before some didn't taste fully like usual still to. Yeah, that's yeah. Mm. Seems like it, you know. Seems like that. I'm not late here, late. Sage, hello. God, no one's on that I want to lurk on. All right, all right. Wednesday. Be like that. Sage, I hope you're I hope you're doing all right. I hope work went well. Oh my goodness! Last night, last night, Aaron and I started playing. Um, uh, Pikmin. Last night, Aaron and I started playing Pikmin. Um. Which uh, was a really good time. 
that game is really fun. Um, we got to, and hey, listen, maybe, maybe it's uh much harder later. Actually, you know, it 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 posed some very specific difficulties immediately. I will say it, it, it was not a happy go lucky silly romp that later I expected to like stop me. It posed in the third level some very specific difficulty around you understanding how to use Pikmin. Um, and I appreciate that. I appreciate kind of like, you know, you have like the intro level where they teach you the mechanics and then they have um, Matt, why are the choices warrior rogue and elf mage? So uh, let me finish talking about Pikmin and we'll talk about Dragon Age. Uh, or let me, yeah, no, I said that, right? Let me finish talking about Pikmin. We'll talk about Dragon Age. So, um, so the first level, obviously there's like the tutorial level where you're getting started. They teach you everything. And then they have like your first real level. And that does a really good job of letting you kind of like mostly save spots to explore, but also challenging you in an interesting way. It gives you the yellow Pikmin. It teaches you how to use the yellow Pikmin. Um, you have some kind of like some good spots of like, okay, I have to understand how to use the yellow Pikmin. I have to understand how to use groups, which I think is going to be a big thing in this game because there's no like swap feature to be like, I'm using the red Pikmin versus I'm using the yellow Pikmin. Um, so you have to use the sort of like group feature, grab them, you know, and, and understand how to swap back and forth. I think that's really cool. Uh, and then I got to, I guess, the third level. It feels weird to say that. The, I mean, I guess it's the third level because it's not, you know, after the tutorial level. You get the blue Pikmin and you really have to learn how to navigate around water. Um, it's very interesting. It's very interesting. I'm very I feel like I'm definitely going to have more than a couple days where I just go like, all right, I'm going to I'm going to try that again. <laughs> We're going to take another run at that. Um, which thankfully, because it saves every day, uh, that's pretty solid. Um, I think, you know, I think I was expecting the save system to be a little meaner, um, but we'll see how it goes in the future. You know, I feel like I'm. I feel like I've played through the easiest part of the game already. So we'll see how <laughs> we'll see how hard it gets coming up, but I'm very excited to play it. It was really fun playing it with the GameCube controller because it felt like it was supposed to feel, you know? Um, I I got to feel the difficulty in managing the camera that a lot of people who played that game uh, have felt, which which is nice. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying it. We're gonna play more of it. Um, Aaron's been wanting to play more Coral Island, um, but her, her wrist was hurting last night, so we did that. Um, and Aris is hurting again, so. So, why are the Dragon Age choices... That's a little too bright. Hang on. Yeah, that's much better. That's much better. Jalen, hello, good morning. Hello, my friend. Um... Now it seems too dark, but also I'll try it. I'll try a little bit. I'll try, you know, what a little stuff. I want a little sunlight, you know, you get a little, get a little sun. Um, so for Dragon Age, the, the Dragon Age poll, the Dragon Age questionnaire, is live um it's very straightforward it's very simple um but sage asks why are the choices warrior rogue and elf mage so um Why did I put Elf Mage? Oh, I remember why I put Elf Mage. I thought through the process of, uh, uh, I thought through my process again. Uh, so for Dragon Age, one of the things I want to do 
is have different characters, right? One of the things for 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 Mass Effect, it was it was easy in a way because you were always Commander Shepard, right? There wasn't a thing where you picked if you wanted to play as a Solarian guy or you wanted to play as uh, a, a, an Asari or anything like that. Um, you know, you weren't playing different characters, right? You're not. We weren't playing different characters. In this, we're playing four distinct characters. And uh, I want to make sure that I don't end up playing four human warriors. Do you know what I mean? Are you taking the highest percentage of picks from each question or picking the favorite combos? It's it's whatever the uh, most popular choice is. So I looked at the series, right? And I was like, well, in three and four, we can play Kunari. So we'll keep that in mind. Um, and in two, we have to be a human, right? Hawk is a human, regardless of what you pick. You know, Hawk is the most kind of predetermined character in Dragon Age. And I was like, well, if Hawk has to be a human, then I would like to make sure that the Warden isn't also human. I would like to, at the very least, make sure that the Warden is something that isn't human. We get something slightly different. Um, and... Uh, so I took human out of the pool, out of the pool of choices. Uh, I might put it back for three and four. We'll see. Um, but, um, so yeah, so that's why you have, uh, elf mage because dwarves can't be mages. So I'm excited. I've never finished any dragon age. They're on my list of games to complete. I really enjoy, uh, the dragon age games like overall. Uh, I think there are things where uh, Bioware has a lot of I think failings is the word I'm going to use. Um, we talked a lot about that. You know, uh, we talked a lot about those during Mass Effect. I'm sure we'll talk about them again during Dragon Age, um, any other Bioware games I play, which I, there will be more, I'm sure. Um, we'll talk about it. Um, and like, it's not like surprising. It's not a special Bioware thing. It's not that Bioware specifically has these failings. It's that I think Bioware creates specific experiences. Um, and uh, I think, you know, has has the the propensity to fall into specific traps a little bit more. So. We'll 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 talk about it more as we as we come up through it, we'll go, hey, look at this, you know. So. I also need to put a list of mods together. Um, just so that it's visible. I should have done that for Mass Effect. Mm. Um, I am not running any big mods. Um, because I was since I was I was looking over it the other day. I'm not running any big mods. I'm not running any big like graphic restoration mods. Um, I'm not running any big um, um, like overhaul mods. I'm going to play the game like majority of how it looked. You know what I mean? Like it's going to look how it looked. And that's that's going to be that. I think for for me, I really enjoy um, seeing a game kind of in its natural state, at least on stream. I definitely have done. Um, I've definitely done, you know, HD mods for my own stuff. I got to go to work. Hopefully it's not too. Oh, yeah. The meeting you were talking about. Right, right, right. Right. The meeting you were talking about. Good luck. Good luck, Ionic. I hope I hope that goes well. I hope that goes well. Um, but yeah, so for stream, uh, I want to I'm not going to do any big overhaul mods. I do have a mod that's like. Um, 
um what is it called like a like a restoration mod like it's a it's a big bug fix mod it restores cut content like it repairs stuff um so yeah i want to i want to present the game as is and i did the same thing with mass effect i did the same thing with mass effect i did some like um i think i installed for mass effect i think i installed like a fix this loading problem mod or something like that um it was like fix controller support for one of them but yeah if it doesn't i'll come back with tea <laughs> I also installed clothes mods. Did I install a clothing mod for Mass Effect? I don't remember that. Celestian, hello. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A bunch of the right. A bunch of casual. Right. I remember this now. I remember this now. Celestian, how are you doing this morning? Look at tiny. Listen, listen. A streak is a streak. A streak is a streak. I appreciate anybody spending spending that much time. Oh, I did install a lot of tech. Oh, I did install um, texture mods for Mass Effect Three. I'm a I'm a dirty liar. I'm a dirty liar. Well. Well, maybe I'll double, you know, maybe I'll go through the, uh, the, the Dragon Age mods again and see, see what's going on. So far doing better than yesterday, just getting into work stuff. I hope, I hope you continue doing better than yesterday. I hope, hope everything, uh, is going better. Oh, goodness. I'm doing all right. I am doing all right. I um We were saying I've got the um we have the the Dragon Age uh questionnaire live for uh Dragon Age Origins. That'll be coming up in a little bit. Um probably Middle of August, which makes me realize I need to start working on September fundraising stuff. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> um and uh Yeah. Everything everything's going alright. Aaron and I started playing Pikmin last night. Um It's been a good Things are things are going alright. Things are going alright. Nice quiet time, you know, nothing, nothing wildly like exciting or bad. And that's fine, you know, <laughs> that's bad. Mm. Mm. Excuse me. All right. Let's <laughs> Nuja Nuja, good morning. Nuja, good morning. Let's get let's get this game going. Ninja, how are you this morning? How are you? We got an ad break right now. We'll get the uh, 
get the game started after the ad break. I like when it tells me about the ad, ad break. Uh, I don't think it uh, it's gonna do that as much as I would like. By the way, I think now that you have Frasier, you can go back to Creed's. Oh, and I can get that Mithril that I missed. Mmm. I can get the Mithril that I missed. <laughs> oh, and get the other three characters. Uh oh. Well, that's even more exciting. Hang on now. Hang on now. Uh, what button do I need to hit? This button. Boom. The shiniest of forces. They're not gonna be any use to you because they're level 21 unpromoted. Listen, that that's fine. That's fine, that just means uh, they suck. <laughs> um, okay, where the hell am I? Right, okay, okay, I kind of, okay, okay, I kind of, okay. I kind of remember where I need to go. Yeah, yeah, let's, yeah, let's do that. Let's have a, let's have a easy start. Let's have a good easy start to stream. I'll go back to Creed and be like, hey Creed, I met this robot. What do you think about that? Back to New Grand Sill and take the nearby Rock River to Creed's. Right. Up. Oh. Okay, this is gonna be the difficulty. <laughs> I didn't know there was a battle. Yeah, I think I. I think I hit the one tile when I tried to go around the town. So good to know when I get to a town, pop it and save. That's that's the trick. That's the trick. When I pass a town, pop it and save. love that you know I thought this was gonna get annoying at the start of the game I kind of love us like with our tank and our homies you know it's fun it's fun rolling around the map with a uh, with a with a big squad, you know. Do, do, do. All right. Oh gosh, right. This is the bombed out cave. Oh, okay, yeah. So we're we're pretty close. Okay, yeah, cool. Oh. Gotta ban you.
take two seconds. Beat me to it? Nah, no problems. Man, that sucks. That's somebody. That's somebody's account that they hacked. That sucks. You know, that's the worst. That's the worst. Matt already has the best viewers. You're damn right. You're damn right I do. Because... Y'all put up with my shit, so. <laughs> the feeling is mutual. <laughs> okay, and then what was down here? Yeah. So I discovered uh, uh, an issue with one of the recordings. Oh, hey, Nuja, we're here. What was up with this fairy thing? Should I do that now or no? If you want to grind levels, you still might be a little under leveled. Yeah, but what if I just get good? An endless spawning battle. That's wild. That that in and of itself is kind of is kind of wild. That's cool. All right. Go through here. Um, okay, so the one that I missed was in Devil's Tale. But I don't remember where it's supposed to be. I think it's here like it's on it's on this map it looks like it's like based on the picture it looks like it's here Force to Devil's Tale. 
Mithril. Northeast Devil's Tail. Right here. Yeah. Sick. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, I'm gamer. Hey, you guys are just chilling. Yeah, come on. I love this idea that like if you um if you come all the way back, you can uh you can recruit these guys. You know that it's like, oh yeah, you get the one, you get the one person to join you before, and then if you think I got, I, I don't know, is there like a, is there a point that you're supposed to think about it and be like, uh huh? Place is also destroyed now. Story-wise, you may think about it later. Oh, is this, is it just like, is there a moment story, like, there's a story moment later where you would go, ah. Otto regained his memory and suddenly went berserk. Oh no. In a fearful face, my master seemed to understand everything. He fell into the sea to stop Adler. What is, what? What do you mean he fell into the sea? Oh, this place is fucked up. I was gonna say, you were like, the place is destroyed. I was like, no, it kind of always looks like this. No. Is Mr. Creed still alive? You wanna save a bit of time, cast Egress on the world map? Oh, I didn't know that would, oh, I didn't know you could do that. That's incredible. Oh, it just takes you back to the last place you saved. That's in, that's amazing. That's amazing. Camelot, man. Camelot knows how to make fucking video games. All right, let's save. I guess we didn't save along the way. It could have taken you back to Moan. Yeah, I risk uh I risk running into into battles, so it was... I kind of dislike how far to the edge of the screen it lets me get, you know. But yeah, true. Oh no, it's the next, there's another, yeah. I was like, I was like, oh, uh, where did the cave go? Can hear, Jalen, hello. Jalen, can you believe we got a fucking bot? What the? Can you believe we got a bot on a Wednesday?
<laughs> Jalen's getting Jalen's getting ready for when uh, when we do still wakes the deep. Jalen's getting his this Scottish ready. Where was it? You still have the warrior pride item. I have no idea. Um, I think so. You get achievement for Randolph's regular and special promo. This Marvel news is maddening Lamo. Yeah, like what are you? <laughs> Who wants this shit? What is it's such a stupid. It's such a bad idea. Okay, hang on, because I, I, I want to talk about this and we just saved. So, uh, it, it's not that big a deal if the, if the emulator wants to be a problem. So let's, hang on, let's, let's talk about this. So, Marvel announced, Marvel announced that comics pages are going to end with a QR code now. Um, and now I, I like, I like that. I like them noting this like here, like, uh, yeah, before you can even buy the comics, they're already scanned and on Reddit. And I'm like, yeah, I get it. Um, so what their plan is, is to replace the last page of the comic with a QR code. And that link won't be live until the day the comic is out. Like. And uh, <coughs> so I saw the news about this from Reddit. And somebody in the comments was like, yeah, the problem with this, aside from obviously all of the immediate problems, is that one, um, it's a direct link. So you could just share the link. Uh, and so instead of, you know, taking a picture of the page, check play online to see the ending, literally. Um, you instead get a shareable link to the last page. Um, the uh, 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 Tom Brevert in an, uh, in an interview described this as like, oh, it's like a bonus page. So, because he was like, he was like, he was like, we're not taking anything away from the book. We're adding a page to it as like a special feature. Motherfucker, that's taking away from the book because you paid someone to make that art and it's not available in the book for the people who paid money for the fucking book. But never mind that. Um, a lot of people in the, this is a great team. God, I look at this team, I get really excited. Um, means collectors are fucked too. So who knows, Are is that gonna be uh, printed in collections? Who knows? Um, it is. I've said for a long time, and this isn't to like shit on anybody in particular. I've said for a long time that buying comics new, buying floppy comics is a terrible endeavor. Um, and I I appreciate and respect everybody who loves their comics hobby. I have a couple friends who who collect comics and and in, and get into it, and I love and respect those people. But God damn it. I I don't know who the like 
I don't know what problem this is actually supposed to solve. Right? It says collections are gonna have the last page, singles just don't. Who wants that? Right. And and it, it seems like one a weird bad way to combat comic spoilers. Two, a weird bad thing to do to the people who buy your books floppy, like you know, like I said, arguably the worst way to engage with comics. Um, but probably a, a sizable portion of your audience. Um, and then three, it's just like a weird shitty thing to do in general. Like, are you going to keep all of these QR codes live for a year? No, you're not. You're going to you're going to be like yeah, after a year. Who cares? You know, it's like the, it's like the Marvel AR stuff. Somebody was talking about it in the Reddit comments like, oh, yeah, the Marvel AR thing where they were like, yeah, you could scan the Marvel AR co code and it'll give you a thing and it'll give you more context. And I'm like, OK, I appreciate that you're trying to engage in a new format. You're trying to engage people in new ways. I can appreciate that. This ain't it, dog. <laughs> this ain't it, dog. Stop scans are me and upload it before the thing is out. They're just going to scan it and update the scan on the day. Right. Uh, and and it it takes them to a direct link to a high quality JPEG. So you're like you're not stop. Do you know how trivial it is to insert a JPEG into a digital comics file? It's laughably simple. I've done it. I've had to <laughs> I've had to break open one of my comics archives and reorder some pages. It's laughably easy. Um. So, yeah, I. This is one of those things. This is one of those things that is like maybe you come up with it in a boardroom and you think about it and you're like, yeah, what? 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 How would this work? Could we do this? Could this work? And then someone else should be in the room and go, no, shut up. No, this is terrible. No, this is a terrible idea. This isn't someone else in that room should have said this is not going to stop anything. This isn't going to resolve the problem that you're trying to solve for. And all it's going to do is piss off our regular fans. Right. It's like the it's, it's like when people like we were talking. I, I, I was talking on Blue Sky with somebody. Uh, they were talking about playing Red Dead. Uh, first one on PC and they were like, oh, yeah, like we, you know, I had a bunch of mods that fix like 16 by nine stuff and give it like, you know, uh, uh, ultra wide and stuff like that. But then Rockstar put in their all their launcher stuff and broke it. And I was like, isn't that fucking isn't that how it works? Like they solved a problem, right? A problem. Um, And all it did was fuck over the people who wanted to engage with their stuff. All it did was fuck up the people who wanted to play their game. And this is the same thing. This is the same thing. You know. Just stupid. Absolutely stupid. All right. I'm just going to close the emulator and restart it. It's just ridiculous. And like I said, it's it's not going to fix anything. No one this this is not going to suck. This is like that's the biggest thing for me. Well, if it isn't Matt Gosh dang caller. Ash, hello. Shocker that I am here on twitch.tv slash Matt Calder. You found me. You've solved my riddle. My next stream, I'm going to make a new stream channel and it's only going to be accessible if you solve an extremely complicated ARG. That's the only way you'll be able to figure out the URL. I'm just gonna stream Dynasty Warriors. <laughs> I'm just gonna stream the least exciting game and I'll be like, oh, good job. Oh, good job. Welcome on in. Um, so this is Battle Who Love Gate. Um
Ash, how are you? How you doing today? Jalen, I was telling, um, I was telling Ash we were playing Generation Zero. Uh, and I told her, I told her all the, all the bad things you said about it. Hello, Chad, I guess you're wondering why I've gathered you here today. You've proven yourself to be Twitch's brightest and smartest. <laughs> you've, you've solved the ancient riddles. And thus, have gained access to the greatest treasure of all. Me playing Barbie's Horse Adventure for the Nintendo Wii. Rejoice! It's a pretty terrible game, lol. <laughs> nah, we had a really good time. We had a really good time. I'm hoping we can make some time soon and um, play some more. All right, what am I doing here? Um, I got the thing. Go through the west gate to go to Nazca. Make sure whoever... Oh, right, I was gonna get the, I was gonna do the thing. I was gonna do the promos. Right, 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 right. Yeah, Ash, how you doing? I hope, uh, hope things are going well. Hope things are nice and simple for you. Nice and easy. All right, derive. Yeah, warrior pride, sick. Well, under the weather today, my internet is out, so I'm resting instead of working. You know, I'm glad. I'm glad you are making a point to rest. Um, I'm sorry your your internet is out. That's a bummer. That's a bummer. All right, let's let's save. So we got to promote Dingleberry. So many people down here now. Randolph. But yeah, I hope you I hope you have a good rest. I hope you enjoy a day of just not doing a bunch of work. Maybe, maybe watch something fun. Being horizontal is good. All right, we'll restart. Uh, let's see, fun things you can watch. Oh, did you watch? Ash, do you watch Quinn's Quest on YouTube? Finish my latest plushie. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Am I just learning that you make plushies now? I do. It's excellent. Okay. I haven't. I haven't. Um, I haven't watched the new one, but I was very excited to see the new one. I was very excited to see the new one. So. All right. I'm gonna restart in case for some reason we don't want. <laughs> We don't want that. <laughs> I 
appreciate his criticisms of a very good game are largely the same as mine. Yeah, a friend of mine that uh, talked to TTRBGs a lot. Um, uh, loves Quinn's stuff because he like he respects his opinion even if he disagrees with him. You know, he goes he's it's like it's like oh, I can I can see how you got here. I don't agree with you, but you know. And so I, I always, uh, I always appreciate those. So I'm, I'm excited to watch the, the new one. Um, cause I bought Mothership not that long ago. Josephine. This dog. have the chat have the chance to uh, get some stuff welcome back ninja during the battle you can win a wish staff what the did I get those tasty achievements I did I did You can order a staff on Wish. <laughs> um, but yeah, Ash, tell me, tell me about, tell me about these plush. Oh. The Nazca. Oh, that's funny. I didn't even. I didn't even put that together. Ash, tell me about these. Uh, these plushies. Hang on. I'm. I'm. I'm curious here. I promised I'd see you again. Come on, let's party. I love. I fucking love the localization on this. I love the localization on this. Some of the lines in this are so good. Stop. You need my war plan. You again, Jessup? Why don't you leave me alone? Xeon left me in charge. Doesn't matter if you're killed or not. Then kill me if you've got the guts to do it. I know. You want me to... You want me to be die. You want me to be die. You want me to be die. Also, she's much bluer in the sprite than um i like that i like that that line happened immediately after i said i love the localization in this and then they made me say you want me to be done i have no time to waste i must go silly camila you cannot survive without my brains or my scarf how did you hear that he said you'd win you must be a bad fortune teller We can get a ship and return to Grants if we defeat her. Poppy, get her! <laughs> Poppy, get her! <sighs> oh, boy. Localizations, baby! You know, it's not even to shit on it. It's just how it is. Okay, so they're here. Oh. She was gonna say you want me to be dead, but mentally switch gears to you want me to diamond send. Isn't that what? And that's what came out. <laughs> yeah, you know what? That's true. That's how we should frame it. That's how we should frame it. I've had that happen in life. Oh, another one of those. Hey, fun fact, everybody. Uh, Aaron saw on uh, TikTok, if you have any of these Apple OEM chargers, like they came with your iPhone, 
if it's this little one, if it doesn't have a green sticker on this side, if it doesn't have a green sticker, these were recalled a while ago and you should toss them. I'll pick up on it on the next patch. Yeah, when they when they when they do all of my my uh, suggested improvements, when they do all my suggested improvements, everyone dig through your cord box. Yeah. Listen, I keep all of my chargers and things right here in the top drawer. Ah, the lines do give you land effect. Hmm. But yeah, uh, apparently the tines can uh, come out and get stuck in the wall and cause a short, which is bad and extremely dangerous. So don't risk it. I've added the latest plushie to the album. Dragon Age and a hello. Oh, this is cute. One of these is a little, uh, a little spooky guy, but he's still very cute. Oh, these are okay. <laughs> I want to be clear when I say these are horrible. I mean that these are of horror creatures. <laughs> oh, these are cute. I love these. These are so cute. Anna, hello. Anna, when are you, when are you gonna play all the Dragon Age games? When are you gonna stream Dragon Anna? I mean, I know you probably did already, but what if you did it again with a funny name? I'm glad you're looking forward to you playing Dragon Age. I tried it years ago, didn't click, so I dropped it. I'm hoping seeing someone else play it will refresh it. I think that is the joy of Ah! I should have boosted! I've already forgot I'm I've brought shame to my house. Yeah, you would. You would at the very least play do Inquisition again. You would at the very least do Inquisition again. Making weird and perfect best apart is part of my mental health practice of resisting the, pre the supremacy culture of Sweden. Yeah, I. You know what? That's a very. It's a very interesting thing, right? Like, like you look at these, and like these aren't bad. Do you know what I mean? These aren't. These aren't like bad. Like, like. Oh, uh, this is. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's not. That's my. That's like not the first thing I think about at all. Like, like, I couldn't do this. Do you know what I mean? I think I think people's perception on a lot of these things. No, but they're weird. They are weird. They are weird. But listen, I've been on the Internet. That's not new. I think people's perceptions on a lot of things like this are so fucked. Because they either compare it to like. Professionally made shit that like they're buying at Walmart, which let's listen professionally made. That's that's a loaded sentence. Um, or they're like, I don't know. I feel like I feel like people get so in their head about the way things are supposed to look, uh, especially in terms of like art and handmade stuff. Yeah, this is good. Um, that they just they just kind of lose the plot and they can't appreciate. They can't just appreciate a thing someone made. You know, they can't just be like, "Wow, that's a that is a thing that you made." That that at the very least, I appreciate because of the time and effort and energy and expertise that it took you to make. I don't, I don't know why. I don't, I just... Make a point of doing things that require my work to be capital G good. 
New standards set by capitalism make us feel like we can't do stuff. Right. Right. People, and, and I fall into this all the time, so, you know, please don't, uh, please don't take this to mean that, like, I count myself out of this, but it's a, it's a, it's a thing I try to remind myself a lot, like, doing something, like, you're going to be bad at it most of the time. It's just how it goes. Because it's a new thing. You know? I follow it all the time, which is why I do practice of resisting it. It's it's partially why um, some stuff on stream takes me so long. Um, because I want it to be right. Um, you know, I want it to be good. Um, I want it to, you know, and I don't, it, it, it's being bad at something is the first step to sort of being all right at something, Jake the Rake or something like that. It's very close. Let me coach you in Dragon Age. And I know how to play it. I know how to play Dragon. I mean, if I'm not naturally good at something the first time, it's not worth my try. I think they're like, I know that that's a joke, right? But also like, that's how people think. Um, and I, I think it's very, very difficult to unlearn that behavior. Um, and, and like I said, like it's, it's something, it's something I'm struggling with, you know, it's something I struggle with all the time. Um, we really just get this guy done. The May didn't get attacked. That's rude. No, cause the game hates me. You must do it until you're good at it and constantly hate that you aren't good. <laughs> and I got it the opposite way. And I got it the opposite way. Oh, you're not good at this. You're going to do it every day forever until you're good. What else for me is instead of expecting a specific outcome, I get curious about what is going to be the results of a combination of my skill level and what I think. It kind of helps the creation look like a loot box that helps my ADHD gets past its perfectionism. So you think of it as like, as like, okay, I want to make a plushie. I'm not going to try to make this specific thing. You're just like, what, what can I make? What could I do? What could I? I think, I think that's a really good idea. I think it's a, that's a, that's a helpful way to look at it. And it might not be a, a way that works for everybody, but it works for you and that's great. You know? Yeah, I, I have uh, I have a very big struggle with learning new things, like starting new things. Um, it's it's very difficult for me to start that process. I'm gonna try to make a bat. Let's see what it looks like when I make that with my skill. Plus, I learn how to adjust what I'm trying to do to fit those skills as well. It makes sense. Uh, take a big hit. Yeah, I, I I struggle with it sometimes, but it's also why 
Um, that's why I talk about the things that I'm doing so much is, is partially like accountability to myself. To be like, you know, I said I was going to do this thing, so I should do this thing. Cuts both ways sometimes, you know? Okay. Gerhold doesn't need another, doesn't need a kill. I'd like, give it to anyone else. Okay, not Poppy. Poppy also doesn't need a kill. Give it to Kazan. Kazan can have a little. Little murder is a treat. guys yo wow okay damn okay. yeah um again dragon age um thing um, Dragon Age Pull is live. If you want to fill it out. Only class blaze 2, not much damage. Now, but he looks cool. Um, help make some of the, the decisions going into Dragon Age. It's like my fourth or fifth time playing the game, so... And apparently, uh, um, I'm a dirty, I'm a dirty big old liar. Um, I did install graphic mods when we were playing Mass Effect. So maybe I'll do that for this. <laughs> I did do that. Yeah, I was looking. Uh, uh, Sage mentioned that I'd installed like clothing mods and I was like, I don't remember that. And I went and looked at my history in Nexus mods. And it was like a lot of textures, Mass Effect 3, a lot of textures, Mass Effect 2. And I went, oh, I did do that. Oh. <laughs> Freeing yourself from the quality expectations, leaning into the doing stuff expectation instead. Yeah, I think, I think, I think that's, that is, that is a very positive, uh, uh, way to be, is much more positive mental effect overall. Imagine, you know, you can use various rings, such as the power ring and the protect ring. No. I didn't. <laughs> uh, use... Oh, he doesn't even have the protector ring equipped. Can you only have one ring? You can only have one dog. What does this do? A crack appears in the... I'm sorry, excuse me? Nuja, what did you just make me do? To his tacky, have some decorum. <laughs> Uh, 
Damn, get got. Oh yeah, don't use it again. What do you mean, don't use it again? <laughs> oh yeah, don't, uh, don't do it. I said you could, but like, don't. <laughs> It'll break forever? I mean, w is it crack? Is this why I gotta repair? Is this the repair thing that I've literally never done? Yes. Incredible. If you put it in the caravan and take it out, it'll be made whole again. <laughs> I love video games. I love video games. <sighs> Excuse me. I hate video games. No, I love video games. I've never, <laughs> I've never hated a video game in my life. And anyone who says otherwise is committing slander. Protector and cast level one boost. That's not bad. I mean, listen, this will probably clean the mud man up, so let's just. Apologize for always yawning. <laughs> Hell yeah, Slade's level 14. Slade learned a new spell. What? How dare you. Slade learned a new spell. Gotta have cool spells if you're a ninja. Yes. Ow. Two in a row, this game hates Matt. Oh yeah, no, we none. I was being I was being for real. I was being for real for real. God, what is happening? What is happening to my body? It's the name of every book from like TV where like one of the kids is like 15 and where their parents walks in with a book that's like, what the hell is happening to my body? Uh, 
listen, just read this book. It will explain it. And it's like, it doesn't. It doesn't. And you're a bad parent uh, for the way that you're engaging with this. I feel like Elric has gotten solid level ups every time. I feel like every time Elric has gotten solid level ups. Interesting thing to know, the way the power wing works is it boosts your pre-weapon attack by 30%. <laughs> that feels like a lot. Mm. Excuse me. Oh my god. I'm yawning so much I hate it. Characters who don't use weapons will see a larger boost than a similarly attack weapon character. <laughs> um. So. Does that mean it is the best idea to. Um. Use it on a mage? You really want to heck a boss up using on Peter or Geralt because that oh I see what you mean a character who doesn't use weapons I see what you mean really use aura right now i you know once i get a turn it's not like i'm picking who goes nuja and also i've been i've been spending everyone's turns setting up a big old cool boost so don't yell at me could use aura but then there's this nice boost i could have yeah listen either way you're gonna yell at me either way you're gonna be like matt why didn't you do this now listen peter get out there do some do some damage You don't need this. Rick, Rick needs this. I think it has to do with Matt Goblin. Matt's Goblin Raid likes to big numbers. Big number, good. Big number, big. Big number, big, big, good. Big number, good.
I don't know how any simpler I can put it. Guess what I remembered I can do. Eat it. Nine XP? Okay. XP. Okay, who who needs a good big heal? Rick. I've been working on um, getting clips from Midnight Suns. That game was good. That game was good. That was a good game. And it sounds was good. There should be more. I, 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 I wish you know, this is one of those things where it's just like, fine, I'll make games myself. Where like, that was such a such a solid idea for a game. Uh, uh, mechanically. You know, the the mechanics and stuff in it were so good. Um, it didn't do. Um. You know, it didn't do the same old, same old stuff. Like, it didn't do the same old card stuff that was like, uh, it's like, oh, it's like Slay the Spire. It's like, no, it's 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 different, you know? And it wasn't, uh, you know, 2D, turn-based, um, you know, like, like Darkest Dungeon. Like, it took the, it took the, it did an interesting thing with the map. Midnight Suns would even make a sweet animated series. I wish they had, um, they, they did do, uh, I think there's a new Blade series happening right now, to be fair. Eat it. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful counterattack into a kill into a level. Hell yeah, Rick. Hell yeah, Rick. It was just, it was just a, just a fun game. Oh, he got, he decided to get two attacks. Hell yeah. He decided, what if I had two attacks? It may have dragged about two thirds of the way. I can see that. I can see that. A lot of games do. A lot of games do. Um, um and I, I, I had, I had like, I had my issues with the story. Like it was by no means a perfect game. It was by no means a perfect game. Um, but it was, it was enjoyable. The gameplay was enjoyable. The gameplay loop was fun. 
especially if you tried 100 percent like if you had to catch a bunch of frogs i don't know why you'd bring that up what a what a strange what a strange example I had, I, had a, I had a good time with it as I'm watching it back uh, I'm remembering how good a time I had with it oh I need more MP well I also tried to get all fully leveled friendships hell yeah Yeah, I didn't I didn't do that. And you know do you know I didn't do that? There was no <laughs> There was no achievement for doing it, so who cares? <laughs> So, but I do need to go back, and uh, I was thinking about thinking about replaying it. She's 13 damage, just a power stick. Yeah, dog, she's she's got it. She's strong. Oh, come on, Rick. Rick, now you're gonna die. Yeah. Look at that, Elric leveled up. Finally got some attack. Oh no, we were talking about May. Yeah, I feel like Elric's always gotten like one to one. It's amazing. Yeah, I'm thinking about um, replaying Midnight Suns. Get the last, um, get the last few achievements, um, and then just sort of just put put the game to bed, you know, and be like, okay, there, you know. I played it. I had a good time with it. Let's let's hundred percent it and send it off, you know? I have a bunch of games I want to do that with. Um, games I want to go back to. Do do a like get all the achievements play through, or get the rest of the achievements. And uh, ah, damn it, finish up and uh, just kind of just. 
just be done with, you know, like in, in that way. Like Yakuza is probably the biggest one. Yakuza like a dragon is probably the biggest one, like. Okay, so I've got one moderate heal left in me. Um, you know, I have like two achievements left to get in like a dragon and they're the two hardest to get. Um, and so like, I feel like I need to Just like put on a podcast, do some grinding. How do you dodge a tank? You know, you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. Um, but you know, like put on a podcast, put on a YouTube series, something like that. Do some grinding, you know, get the get those ultimate weapons made. Just get it done. Also planning your turns, Camille is the boss. Yes. I I figured, but yes, it's good to it's good to know. Ow. Oh shit. Well, Now, boost is still active. Future proof, hello! Future proof, how are you doing, my friend? It's good to see ya. Simic Coffee finished two projects last night? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, I love that. I love that. I love the I love the feeling of getting stuff done, you know? It's for a large client in the metal community could lead to a regular gig. Hell yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Tell me surprised when I learn neurotypicals will try affiliation when they get things done instead of relief. Yeah, word. That's, that's been a big thing. That's been a big thing for me, like playing video games, is that like, I just feel frustration the whole time. And then when I, when I like do finally do it, I'm just like, oh, thank God I can, I can get on with my fucking life. I didn't maybe pay rent without sweating six days beforehand. Listen, I love that for you. I hate this. I hate this. Why are you attacking my ladies? What's wrong with you? I'm just gonna get the fuck away. How are you? I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. Um, I spent yesterday um, I spent yesterday, uh, working on, oh, good dodge, um, working on editing clips 
from stream. Um, and uh, got through two videos. So that's that's two stream VODs like officially out. Hey, guess what? <laughs> Idiot. Um, what do you use to edit? I use it. Yeah, I use resolve. Camila reveals the sky orb. Hell yeah. With it, you can drive the Nazca ship. Listen, you have to be very careful from now on. Jessup has prism flowers. He will. Your life is over, Camila. Damn. Ha ha ha. You acted just as I planned. Uh, just. Damn. It's the law. Traitors die by fire. Congratulations, you have a ship now. Come to Grants. I have to go now and prepare your welcoming party. What a, again, what a fucking line. I really hate him. Prism flowers, what are they? I have no idea, but it's probably a trap. Ancient flower. Excuse me? Dog, you... Ancient countries had those flowers along their borders. What kind of flowers are they? I cannot explain. And we'll see them when we arrive at Grand's. Bobby, grab the Skyrim. Let's go. You have black magic long before resolve. Some more serious video cameras. Hell yeah. Um. But yeah, so uh, so I was working on editing editing clips and highlights and stuff and ah the ah okay okay I'm gonna I'm gonna go back right here and get everybody alive and save um But yeah, working on that, working on the Dragon Age stuff, working on the Dragon Age uh, form. And realizing now that I need to spend time scheduling for September. Ugh. Yeah, I'm just getting, just getting stream stuff done. Is it, you know, you have to, uh, you have to like constantly be promoting yourself in, in weird ways, um, or ways that I find weird, I guess is a better I guess it shouldn't, I guess I shouldn't feel weird about, like, putting my stream clips on my Insta. Because, oh, wow, okay, that's silly. Nazca Cannon? Uh oh. You can equip one of your archers with a literal airship cannon. Listen, it's got it's gotta go on the tank. Oh, but it will make may it may may be stronger. You know what, but May's already a 67, so. Look at look at this. Look at this room of warriors. I Hey, 
Hey, Higgins, you good? Like... I like that I like that I like that she's excited to be here for because Elric's here, but Elric is all the way up here. Yeah, look at this. All the all the fucking warriors. This is cool. Gumpy, my boy. Gumpy, my beautiful son. You start the ship by placing the sky orb in the cockpit. Is this the cockpit? Is the sky orb a thing I literally have? Yes. Well, now we have an airship. Sick. I've never experienced anything like this in my 70 years. I'm gonna save that as a reaction meme. Oh, we're flying! The engines were greater than we thought. Oh, thank you very much. Poppy is almost here already! Yes, sir, with an ancient aircraft. I'll be passing over the cape soon. I love just talking, I love just facing a wall. Good, I'll do anything to get my powers back. Yeah, you're evil. This doesn't... They're stronger than we thought. But I have an idea. Please let me try it. No! I think it's better for us to shoot them down over the cape. Yeah, it sounds legit. <laughs> He's still damaged from his battle against Vulcanon. Take Red Baron instead. That Jessup, he wants everything. Hey, wait a minute. That guy looks familiar. I was just thinking of Poppy's hidden powers. We must never underestimate him. Anyway, it'll be a fantastic show. Ha 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 ha. Finish the preparation before the Nazca ship flies over the cape. How are the prism flowers? They're ready. Excellent. Now come on, Grand Sail losers! Love it, so funny. There's Grand's Island. I'm gonna call her the Grand Sail loser. <laughs> We finally come home. I see the Nazca ship. Everybody get ready. Man, this game rules. This game, this game, this game fucking slaps. Nancy, you must be seeing things because you're so old. Ha 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 Someday, Peter, I'll kick your little bird ass. One day, Peter, I'll kick the absolute shit out of you and I'll take your ashes and I'll bury them at the bottom of the sea. 
Got a merch idea if you want to hear it? Yeah, hit me with it. So the prism flowers are like anti-air <coughs> energy rifles. What is that, lightning? An attack from the ground. I can't control the ship. Well, I mean, you're standing there in the middle of the thing, so I don't know why that would... I love we, f we went directly into his trap. Sink, can you land on the cape before the... before it crashes? I'm not sure, but I'll try. Hey, Zink, I like your wild driving. Where's Sir Astral? He's right there. Oh, there he is. Hey, hey, buddy. Okay. Thinking a portrait of you with its uh, face with red uh, red marks, a crossed out eyes, double horns, funny mustache. Uh, when your name is Matt's been crossed out and Mark is written instead. <laughs> That's kind of funny. I like that. Get off the ship. I'll go first. We must finish our preparation before Jessup finds us. All right, come on, everybody. That's just what everybody says. Yeah, it's just what everybody says. That's funny. I actually can't talk to the crab tank. The crab tank has no input. What a terrible waste. We've lost an ancient treasure. Anyway, we have to go to Ark Valley. Poppy, let's go. All right, am I gonna get a save point? Oh, is this that? Yes. I used to be a priest. Do you need my help? Hell yeah. Do, 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 do. So what's going on here? Um... Oh, hey. Deep well. Okay, well, that's not what I wanted. Uh, it's on the left side. Yeah. Oh, I can. Oh, I can get back here. Uh huh. Nope. 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 
Where? There we go. Ba -da 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 -da. We did it. Keep going. Is that is that delayed or is there another thing? More like Jaha, am I right? You know, I wish he was. I, with a name like Jaha, you'd think he'd be very jovial. Continue the way you were going. Oh. Who's there? Oh. This is a sacred place. Oops. She's too <laughs> she's too beautiful for you. Wait, is that Sir is that you, Sir Astral? What? <laughs> you know me? Oh, you don't remember me? Well, uh, sorry. I'm Sheila. I was a pu pupil of yours in Gallum. I was preparing to become a priest. Sheila! I can't believe it! How is that scar in your chest, remember? You snuck up behind me and tapped my shoulder? And you kicked me in the chest! I like this lady. Nobody but Sheila knew about that scar. It still aches sometimes. I am sorry I kicked you. Well... That okay. I came to kill Red Baron. He killed my fiance. Cool. Why did you come back to Grands? To reseal Zeon. The King of the Devils? Listen, Sheila, all the killings lately were caused by him. He'll destroy the entire world. He must be stopped. Is Red Baron his follower? Could be. <laughs> well, maybe. Hmm. Okay, I'll do it. Close your eyes. Sir Astral, please let me go with you. We welcome you, but can you fight? I've made my body into a weapon. Where did you learn to do this? You're a priest. I was, but now I'm a master monk. We could always use... We... <laughs> uh, Sheila, the monk. Love to have another monk on the team. You've got a strong ally. Many Gallum soldiers are in the West. We must be careful. About to roll three monks deep. <laughs> Your body is a weapon. Your body is a weapon. Big punching hands. All right. Again, I love that she's. I love that, like, I love that she's there. She's like, yeah, I'll join you. Let me just walk around. Um, so do we need to... Do we need to, uh, uh, swap stuff? Um, yeah, we can do the Karna promos now. Uh, do... Do I want Karna to end as a monk or a vicar? <laughs> Is always the thing. Like, what do I want to end up with? 
She's the weakest of the three monks, but Monk is broken. There's a lot of things in this game that are broken. Probably Monk, they're bananas. Okay. Yes. No. Broken in a good way. I forgot I was gonna try front lock. All right. Restart. <laughs> Future, thank you for the clip. I appreciate that. I miss if you caught the merch concept. I did. I did. It's a, it's a, it's a fun idea. It's a fun idea. I've never really, like, thought that hard about merch for stream, you know? Like, too hard for merch working in the game. Yeah, like I've, th I've thought about it, but it's more been like the thoughts that I've had about it is like, oh yeah, that would be cool. And then that's it. One of the achievements is for using Sheila to kill a boss a few battles down. Oh, if you, I guess if you use her to kill the Red Baron, that makes sense. Did you get the Brave Apple? No, I did not get a Brave Apple. And the last Mithra, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Sanders are trying to wear a hole. In Listen, they're, they, you know, they're training. They're doing a good job. And they did, they did hide these mithril's. Oh, it's on the other side. This area has probably made the most sense overall where it's like, oh yeah, we went to a dojo. We did it. All the mithril. I'm gonna double save. I'm gonna I'm gonna save again. Um but trade is back in the Genesis area. They had a game with an overworld map and they reward you for exploring. Yeah, word. Like I do appreciate that it's like that like that mithril was the one of the most obvious mithrils. Um, and even then.
Uh, where was my tab? There we go. In the next battle, you can win a heat axe. I have no idea what that means. Saw a post got me this morning to me. Way too long to realize you shouldn't stay friends with people who never ask how you're doing. Ah, mm. That's the axe the, wizard, the lizards are using. Oh, that's, oh, okay. Hmm. I feel like that's one of those things that is punchy. Um, it sounds a bit reductive. That's the, the that's that's what I'm going for. Like we were talking about this in an in a in a Discord that I'm in where we talk about TTRPGs a lot, and we were talking about a tweet that um, Grant Howitt had, which was like, actual plays are, uh, um, actual plays are what sex is to porn, or, or flip that. It's like actual plays are what porn is to sex. And it's one of those things where it's like, I feel like if I had a conversation with Grant, like I could, I could, you know, you get more out of him, you'd get more detail, you'd kind of understand what he's getting at. Um, and and I think that there's a like a germ of an idea in there that I agree with. But I also think that by reducing it to like 10 words to for it to fit into a tweet so that it's punchy like it loses all nuance and that's kind of that's my biggest problem with social media these days is that there's no nuance ever. Um, and people like actively push back on things having nuance. I don't take it literally, I take it more, don't stay friends with folks who don't care. Yeah, and I, and I think that's how a lot of people will take it. But also, I've been online long enough to know that there will absolutely be people who are like, Oh, well, my friend didn't ask me how I was when I saw them today, so obviously they don't care about me. And it's like, that's not, it's not, it's not what they said. It's not what happened. Um, and so like it, it it's one of those things, right? Where I'm just, where I'm not like, I'm not like that person's wrong. You know what I mean? Like, cause that's a, that's a, that's just as bad a response the other way. You know, that's just a, as bad a response the other way. Um, but it, it, it makes me go like, hmm. What if you, what if you use more of those characters that, you know, the, the, the social media platform lets you use? Wouldn't that be cool? But. But yeah, I, 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 I get it. You know, no snap, o only snap. Yep. Um, who do we cut? Who's the lowest attack right now? That remind me of our parents' generation talking about treat others how you want to be treated. No, love what you're going for. It's self-absorbed. It's a radical thought. Maybe treat others how they want to be treated. Right, right. And that's the thing, right? That's the thing. That idiom makes sense if you take it to mean treat others with kindness and respect because they will then also, if, if everyone is doing the same thing, treat everyone with kindness and respect. And the problem is, like you said, 
instead that centers you. Um, he doesn't actually have the, the cannon equipped. Um, and instead puts your feelings at the forefront and is like, oh, well, I'm the most important person, which is half of the reason we have the problems we have right now. The other half is bigotry, but... It was just me, I don't find it hard to be just kind of disrespectful, super frustrating. Right. Yeah, right, Gerhal has two rings. Thank you for that reminder. It's annoying that he can't have two rings considering he doesn't have a weapon. That seems... He's got two hands. You know? Yeah, deserves two rings. Yeah, he, listen. He works so hard. Uh... Uh, uh, Ninja, do I need to keep the Sky Orb in my inventory, or should I put it in the... Should I put it away? Maybe Kazan needs it? What's Kazan's looking? Ooh. Ooh. God, you're right. You can put it in the caravan? Okay, good. Yeah, Jesus. Did, you, did I put in my power ring to repair it? No, thank you for the reminder. Deposit. Cause it, uh, no. Geralt, power ring. Yeah, it's like, it's like the people who say like, uh, respect has to be earned. If anyone ever says respect has to be earned, I immediately, I immediately know that they're, they're not serious in their, in their opinions. Oh yeah, Nuja, Nuja has been. Harping on me, I think, is, is actually the correct word to play this for the longest time. Ugh. But in that way of, like, you want someone to play your favorite game, you know? You know, in in the way in the way that you're like, hey, I really enjoy this game. I want people to try this game that I enjoy. You know, it's how like for the longest time I told everybody to play Alan Wake One. Okay. <sighs> right, we were we were looking at who who to kick out. I tell you to stop if you weren't actually enjoying it. Well, no, that's the thing. I, I was like, I was like, I'm gonna enjoy this. This is. May strong. Geralt strong. Rick. I feel like Rick is strong. You know. I feel like Rick can hang. What if you can compare Rick and Jaro? Maybe May and L rank? Um. So Elric is uh, is ahead on May on defense. Um, and all of the rest of the numbers are pretty similar. Which, when you if you consider that Elric is two levels behind May, 
looks worse than <laughs> looks bad. Um, and he has more HP. Remember that, right? That's why I'm not comparing their attack. That's why I'm not comparing their attack. I know Elric is behind in terms of attack, but in terms of right, the move, the move is a big deal. Um, who is the other one? Rick and Jaro. And we can see them both on the same screen. Jaro is way behind Rick. Jaro is way behind Rick. In every respect. And they both have the same weapon right now. So, hey, guess what? Jaro, why don't you take a rest? Jason can fly, can ring fly. <laughs> Heal, blast, muddle, and boost. Sick. Look at all these, look at all these weirdos. I got you, I got you. Listen, it's very funny that some of the people in this game are called, like, Rick and Chester, and some of them are called Screech and Jaro, so... You know? You got another booster, I worry. I'm just gonna be over boosting everybody. I'm just gonna be like, boost! I can't, I can't boost anymore. What have you boosted? I literally can't boost. Why are you doing this? Time for boost! Uh, head towards the town of Roft. I don't, I don't know where that is. You say that as though I know. I mean, I'm gonna guess it's the way I haven't gone, but. You're still alive? Jessup. Unbelievable. You really are persistent. We'll never stop. We will not die until we destroy all of you. That's true for you. This is a good break time. You're right. This is a good break. I didn't see what time it was. I didn't see what time it was. Thank you for thank you for pointing that out, Ninja. I didn't see what time it was. Hey, I'm going to take my morning break. Um because, uh, yeah, this is a good time for it. Um, God, we're getting so close to the end of this game, and then also there's so much. <laughs> there we're getting so close to the end, but also there's so much. Um, so yeah. Uh, I'm gonna take my morning break. I will see everybody uh, back here in a little bit. We'll do game bill. We'll do all that stuff. Um, if you haven't lately, take this opportunity to take a break, refill your water, uh, get up, take a stretch, go to the bathroom, uh, you know, uh, check in to see if you need to have food. Do you need to have any meds? Do you need to do anything like that? Walk your pets, do anything that you gotta do. Uh, this is a great time for it, depending on where you are in the morning. Um, but I'll see everybody back here just a little bit.